Alright, J-Rex, you're on deck. This is it. J-Rex test. RFB, ship acceleration physics model. I'm going to go out and check out the convoy before we ever get spotted. Bring the submarine down to periscope depth. Check out the station keeping, gotta compare it to the. Uh, I've imported it directly into the stock game, so we've got an identical setup. Well, I'll tell you one thing the station keeping in the convoy is flawless compared to Webster's. Look at that. Perfect, wonderful straight lines. Let's see if it stays that way, but this is in order of magnitude size than Webster's columns were. Let's see what our station keeping is. We should have our crazy river boat back here someplace. There he is. And our destroyer over here. All the Murchies lined up in nice straight lines compared to Webster's here. Let's see if it remains that way. Check it out, still pre-contact. Okay, here we are looking from about 7,000 yards away. Uh, you can see that the columns have deteriorated just a little bit here. Uh, we'll go in and take a look. I believe that's going to be our uh, destroyer or our riverboat. Uh, destroyer is going to be back here somewhere. There's a bunch of, bunch of uh, ships that are not appearing on the radar. No, I'm sorry, this is Periscope. We're underwater. So, of course, we're not going to see everything there is to see. Let's whip out there and take a quick look. Here we are. And we can see the columns. Barber. I say that it's a little better than Webster's, but they're not precise columns. I certainly couldn't have been detected yet. Destroyer. Where's Joe Riverboat? There he is. Contact. Warship. Constant distance. Bearing. Three. Five. Two. Long range. Actually, a little nicer station keeping here is what we're saying. Let's cut out just a little bit. Falls to 6,000. We'll plug one and see what happens. We're surfacing. We're going to do a surface action. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to plug one boat.
let's get us a hit. That looks pretty good. Yeah. Destroyer with a bone in his teeth. Return to game. Let's see what's happening here. Okay, these ships are accelerating slower than Webster's mod. They're also exhibiting a little more intelligent. Uh, so it's of course is here. And there's our destroyer. Destroyer's going fast. Let's see if we get any collision type behavior or anything here. Looking good, looking good. There he is. He's charging through. He's clear. This is the guy we need to watch. Ah, he's turning to avoid. J Rex, we have a winner. Have a winner. Well, maybe we'll see. Is he gonna miss? Is he gonna throw it in reverse? What's going on here? Now oh, he's gonna miss easy. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Nice turn. Nice speed sustaining through the turn. Very good. Good scattering behavior. Okay, we'll go look for our friend, the riverboat. I don't have to look very far. All I gotta do is look for the guy going fast. Not bad. All right, folks. I think we have a winner. I like it. I think Webster's clearly is not quite as good here.